Hello and welcome to this first look mod video. Today we're going to be looking at the old storage shed by Black Sheep Modding. Let's go. And there are two versions of the old storage shed by Black Sheep Modern. There is one with the automated storage and there is one that is you know, manual fill stacker old school style. So for the old school manual fill, under sheds, go down for 9,000. Bring that out. And you may have seen we've got a customization option um, where we can do this so it has a left side or a right side. So open left or open right. So we'll do this one with the uh, that way like that yeah i'm happy with that <laughs> and then next up if we go over to silos and we come down this is where you will find your um, automatic one and this one's an extra thousand so the 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 manual fill nine thousand uh maintenance upkeep of five pounds euros or dollars um it's 10 by 24 meters like i say there's a an option of left or right and then with the automatic fill storage, again, we press F. You can have a left or right fill, or left or right handed, I guess, is what it is. But it's, it's just to deter, to, 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 I can't get my words out today. It's just to determine which side the uh, the wall is. Right, so I'll put my teeth in. Hopefully we can get through the rest of this video. Uh, so I'll, I'll pop this up next to it as well. And then we can compare the two literally side by side. Try not to get the shadow in it. All right, let's get down and have a look. So again, this is the old storage shed by Black Sheep Modern. I don't know why I can't speak today. I'm going to have to get my torch out. Everything's dark. Now, Black Sheep Modern, so, uh, you know, we can anticipate a quality build with these guys. And, um, yeah, it's looking so... Although, I must say, that texture overlap there is a little bit, a little bit weird. I don't mind. Um, yeah, other than that, looks really nice. Old rusted shed. Girdering. The back's all right. I just want to check. Yeah. It's just, just the way that they've textured it, I guess. We've just got the extra the extra layer of brick on the bottom there. Either way, nice shed. Nice old European style shed. Most people will be familiar with this shed. I like it. So then we have, we've got the tea family brain. Let's put the triggers on. So then we have the uh, the auto stacking shed. So the the fill is on the left. Or oh, sorry, fill on the left. Or are we dumping? We're dumping on this side by the looks of it. And then they're stacking over there. Sorry. So this will be the trigger. Not awake. Again, same model. Should have gone for a left and a right, shouldn't I? Instead of two, two, two rights. But yeah, I like, I like that. So then you can fit it on your farm any either either way, which is really nice. Sometimes sheds come and they are sort of open one end, and then there's no option to have it the other way round without turning it round, and then obviously the shed faces a different direction. So that's pretty cool. Again, something that would be really nice if we could see from more modders. But it does mean taking the time to duplicate a a shed or a model and, and put it in and sort of flip a wall and stuff but i think that's that's that something extra that really makes some modders stand out with the customization of things but yeah i think it's a really nice shed let's uh let's see it in action so we're bringing the style 6200 in to have a little look at this with us and we are going to because there's no clear square marking as to where to unload these so we're going to go for the bay three and we're going to see if that works maybe a little trial and error putting the reverse into the test as well now so if we unload it we'll see how it goes i'm, I'm going to put the stumbling over the words all through this video down to the fact that this is the eighth first look video I've done in a row and my brain is getting all the information confuddled so we drop them instantly in which is nice and there they are all stacked up lovely job 
really nice really functional really clean it works it does what it's supposed to you know you, like i say you can go for the convenience option like this or you can go for the do-it-yourself option like this i like both it depends on the play style that i'm doing on that particular map at the time um, I, I shall eventually probably use both of these at some point again i think these would fit in quite nicely with my uh, my attempt at a british dairy as well so uh, yeah really nice but that was the old storage shed by black sheep modern apologies for stumbling through this one a bit it must be time for bed uh, but hopefully you've enjoyed it hopefully uh, you like the mod if you do you know you know where to go to download these mods go to the modders direct go to mod hub try not to go to these third party sites that are siphoning off everyone's mods at the minute it's absolutely disgusting what we're seeing the amount of mods and converts that are coming through that people don't have permission to be doing um, it's, it's quite disgusting it annoys me it irritates me it infuriates me people put a lot of time into making these mods and just because you like to mod in 19 or 22 doesn't give you the right to convert it over and release it yourself before the modder has had a chance to do it they will do it in their own time they will do it to the best that it can be be patient so again apologies for stumbling through this one Hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you have, give it a big fat thumbs up down below. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Turn the bell notification on. Find out when new videos are going live. As always, comments and feedback down there. You guys have a wonderful day, and hopefully I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.